Really, Lucy? Are you even on? Oh, okay, we are. <laughs> hey, troops. All right. Let's do Sunday vibes. Let's do it. Let's do it. Do it. Do it. Hey, this is the deck I want. No, that's not the deck I want. I must have brought them upstairs. Oh, bummer. Alright, I guess this is the deck I'm going to use. I guess this is it. Alright, so. Let's see what we get. Let's see what we get for Sunday vibes. What's happening? This obviously is going to go into midweek, okay? Like, obviously, like, oh my god. <laughs> I so just went valley on you. All right. Next few days, please. Next few days. Okay. So we have the Queen of Water. Oh, I'm going to leg out of that. Cancerian. Pisces, Scorp. You just yell? Huh? Oh, okay. So, it looks like the Queen of Cups is going to send a message or get a message. And it's a message of Earth. Okay, so it's, it's Pentacles. Why is this a clear? Hold on, troops. Let me switch the lights. Excuse me, Okay. So, this looks like it's regarding work. Just hear my knees. I'm telling you. I'm telling you. So, it looks like this is definitely regarding um, work. The start of your work week, okay? Let me just grab. Oh. All right, that's, that's not it. That's that's a little better. There you go. All right, so it looks like. The Queen of Cups, which can be any energy, okay, but Cancer Pisces Scorpio is going to get a message, and it looks like it's definitely regarding work. So let's see. Or give a message, send a message, email, text message. Sometimes I look as a as an apology card, but not not with this deck. And we got the four of air. So whatever this is regarding work, love, whatever situation ship you're in, you're gonna have to meditate on it. You're gonna have to go within. It's deciding what you're gonna do. Let me get one more. Whoa, 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 whoa! Ace of Earth. Okay, so. And then the seven of earth is at the bottom of the deck. So, this is an opportunity given. Okay. Um, divine, spirit, whomever. Um, I'm going to look at that. So, I kind of feel like, let me put that up a little bit. I kind of feel like it's definitely regarding work. It's a new start. But considering right now that you have to go within and decide whether or not you're going to do this, because are you going to invest time or not, right? Um, it looks like something you may have done in a past life that it's very possible you may have walked away from. So that's why I'm thinking 
it's either not going to feel right or it's going to be one of those situations where do I have the time to do this? Can I give it my all? Or this looks, sounds, feels like deja vu type thing, right? So it's, it's going to go one way or the other. One way or another, I'm going to find you. I'm going to get you, get you, get you, get you one way. If this is regarding love, I mean, I see it as clear as day work is what I'm getting when I'm cutting the deck. But if that's the case, it looks like you're going to send a message. And the message you send is, is healing. And now it's like rejuvenating energy. Now it's time to put your thoughts, what, your time elsewhere. Okay? Because that would be after heartache. If it's regarding love. So tell me about the queen of water. But I like this because if you ask me, this is straight up regarding work. Queen of water, please. Next few days. <clears throat> There's just so many pence, you know what I mean? Yeah, see? Seven of pence once again. And it's right here. So look at this. See what I'm saying? It's 77 is all about getting on your path, your divine path. And this is something you had to have done in a past lifetime. Okay? Well, once again, and I, I'm saying this is reversed. I feel like that's why I feel like you walked away from, right? And then with the five of fire, it's, it's the same thing, you know, like thinking about it. So I really want it. And then, and then there was the magician. So, you know, it's, you're going to have to consider. This is considering where you actually want to invest your time your money. Something's growing. This is telling me a seed was planted. It's almost like a gift from the universe. This is actually a beautiful, beautiful, beautiful read. See, because there's six over here. See the one right there? It, it grew. It's ready. Here it is. Ace of Earth. It's ready. Okay? So, it's like, and that song just came to me. Ready or not, here I come. You can't hide. So, it's 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 here it's universal it's given it's an opportunity whether you take it or not so tell me about the messenger earth and to me it's it's definitely regarding work and it's going to be a commitment it's it's, it's time okay so there we go and the world came out so and the world was reversed which is telling me once again this has to be deja vu for something so it's, i mean someone for something, right? Um, it flipped, but I'm not going to put it out there. So this is a new direction. This is a new path. But it's going to require hard work, commitment. Tell me about the four of air. So to me, that's meditation, contemplating. It might have to do with a past loved one or a past job. Maybe it didn't go so well. I'm not really sure. And the Empress wanted to pop out too. So this is beautiful because whatever you invest time into with this new opportunity right here, it is going to bring the Ten of Pents. This project, project, work, family life, okay? But I am telling you right now, you can look at this as love, but considering all these pens, to me, this is straight up work. And it's going to be hard work. This is not right off the bat, you're going to get this. This is you invest your time and you go in a new direction with whatever this is, whatever work endeavor this is, okay? It doesn't have to be fancy work. doesn't have to be corporate. can be, okay? Um, but just in general, this will bring you the Ten of Pence. This is a gift. This is getting you on your divine path, your mission. Tell me about the Ace of Earth. So you're going to have to go within, and, and some of you, I mean, it might be one of those things where the money is amazing, or you have a family, but it's like, there's going to be travel. You know, so it's, this is really, you really have to consider, don't just yay or nay off the bat, okay? Um, I say, if you say yay right off the bat, you're probably okay, but I wouldn't nay it right off the bat. Tell me about the Ace of Earth. So Spirit's giving this to you. There you go. Page of Pence. Now you got it twice. 
brand new start, new direction. You know, it's it's karma too. Meaning, cause the world, it's it's Saturn. It's it's a gift, okay. But it's it's work. This is karmic balance within your life. And then once again, you're the six of cups. So I'm telling you, you've done this before. Or this is karmic balance for somebody in a relationship. Or you could be working for the government. It really just depends. Politics, government. I want to see if this is travel. Tell me about the two of wands. Could be travel, relocation, or just going in a new direction. They're going to offer something to you. And it's a seed. You're going to have to create, especially with the magician being under there. Two of wands, two of wands, please. It's a beautiful, beautiful opportunity. All right, and then you have strength with the five of wands. So, like I said, if this is work, I you know people might not like what you do. It's it's definitely a competitive industry if it's work. And to have the strength, you know, is is legitimately telling me. It is there's some type of karmic balance that's not balanced if that makes sense it is time to align and I don't know if this is just you fearing putting so much work and dedication and effort into something or someone but I'm going to say something that would be fear strength knowing you can do it all these cards have one person in it except for competitive energy right or back and forth, what do I want to do? So it's, this is a major responsibility for someone, okay? That would have to do with a past life, or like I said, if there's travel in this competitive ind industry, it's, it's having the strength to be bold enough to know it's competitive, but to also know it's going to lay a, f a solid foundation for you. The opportunity is given. You might even get, um, with this, how this looks right here, I don't see the six of pence, but like how this looks to me, it might even be like a sign-on bonus because it's, it's the ace with that, right? So it's it's fresh, it's new, you're learning something new too, but it's, it's double the money. It, it, there might be a sign-on bonus. Uh, tell me about the Ten of Pence real quick, because this is this is what it's going to bring you, okay? So this is you going back and forth in your head. This is telling me that there's a possibility that one of you guys will sabotage this. Or I don't know if it's one of those things where it's, it's too good to be true. But I don't think so. Those two together, that's not always lies and deception, okay? That's that's facing a fear, facing something to get to where you need to be in life. It's like a redo. I just saw like a light, a light switch get flipped. It's a redo, okay? That's not, that is not a bad thing. And it, it's, it's coming in quick. It's coming in quick. Once again, you know... You got a soulmate here. So I don't know if at one point there's going to be a lover or this work endeavor might turn into a lover situationship. But this is this is going to come in quick. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Today, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday. Tell me about the page of pence. So I'd be real careful. I'd really consider this because some of you might blow this opportunity thinking you won't get the ten of pence. They want me to do all this work in this competitive industry or whatever it is and it's just starting off little will be smart because the cards are telling you that that's not the case but because of I think the whole deja vu or the fear you're gonna be like I don't know so just don't nay right off the rip please tell me about the page of pence this is definitely a redo for you guys so this is a brand new investment. 
whoa, that flew way over here. <laughs> it's going to give me the same exact message, okay? Go within. Go within. Do not just nay this right off the bat, please. Look at it. Brand new. Brand new endeavors, okay? At the bottom of the deck with the, with the Pisces, Priestess, Intuition, using it. Could it be a secret organization where you got to keep your mouth shut? Absolutely, for some. And then you have the Seven of Wands. So once again, fighting people off, or it's either the competition, or it's you battling yourself. So be careful here. Quite the opportunity that is presented to some ladies and gents out there, okay? So tell me about justice. Justice, justice. And it was the Five of Pence reversed. But it flipped when I did this, but I'm, I want to grab another one. So this is telling me there's some money issues. And it's no longer going to be a money issue. This is going to be karmically balanced. Your finances will be karmically balanced. Okay? That's going to be a fantastic feeling. Tell me about justice. And you got the queen of swords. Okay? So that's being smart about this decision about your future okay and she's just the one thing I'm getting from her is her intelligence you know this is mental consideration I, I would not put your emotions into this you're going to have to be compassionate depending on what you do for work but when it comes to your decision Okay, yeah, it's, it's, you're arguing with yourself. See what I'm saying? But it's like, don't do that, because look at, all you got to do is, is think about what it is you really want, see? Okay, so I just want to clarify this Seven of Pence real quick, and then we're going to wrap it up, Seven of Pence. And it's like they're looking right at each other. So um, it's, you know, to me, it's just this energy, you being in this energy of the Queen of Cups. There you go. All right. Wishes coming true. Um, I don't know if you've been dreaming of this. To me, this is wishes coming true, especially with this. You, you're, you've already manifested this. It's here. Once again, there could be travel, relocation. But this is where you end up when it's said and done. It does look like feminine energy, <clears throat> but this could be for a masculine, okay? <clears throat> and if that is the case, you need to, <clears throat> if you're going on an interview or whatever the case may be, or just a new department within the business, you need to have, you need to portray more of the feminine energy, okay? <clears throat> you just need to be <clears throat> a little more delicate. All right, show, <laughs> show your delicate side in a, in a masculine way, okay? So next few days, dragon, please. Next few days. What a beautiful spread. And you just pulled that alpha dragon. Man, is that coming out, okay? So it's, okay, this is contradicting exactly what I just said because it says harness the divine masculine power of, cre of crea uh, creation, which is all about the Cappy Moon, too. Right now it's masculine, okay? But it's like, Destroying the old and visualizing new dreams. So look at this opportunity as an investment for your future, no matter what's getting offered to you. Okay? Help manifest a new world. Okay? So it's it's, it's taking that, that leadership role to really... If you ask me, this is a leadership role. This is regarding the job. You're about to create a whole new world. And I don't know for who or when... But that's, that's exactly what it's telling me. You're about to create something beautiful. And it really makes sense because right here, you have the magician. Okay. So this is a big leadership role for somebody. You are alpha. You are going to be the boss, the project manager, the, the go-to. 
okay? Even if it's you work in a pharmacy, eventually you'll be the go-to. That could lead to other things. This does not have to be a dream job right off the bat. Please believe that it is a new opportunity. If you've been looking for a job, you've been on, you know, LinkedIn, Craigslist, newspapers, whatever you do these days, something will come to you. It will be presented to you. It looks like your boss might be feminine because that could be her or that could be her delivering you a message, right? Because it looks like you're most definitely this person. You're the page of pens right here. You're the page of pens. So and you look feminine here too. And this could be your boss. That's Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Or she's just really smart. Okay, but something is about to be karmically balanced. She's going to offer you the new opportunity. It is going to get you out of a financial crisis or it's just going to help your finances. This is being karmically balanced which is beautiful because that means with the world you did complete something some of you this will be deja vu others of you you're gonna be like I don't know you will feel this in your soul for some it's going to be a hard decision maybe you're in a position where they say listen we're taking away this this department and we're asking you to step down. But in the long run, I'd say even within a few weeks, a few months, this department will take off. And it's going to create that for you. Because people always look at new opportunities as being brilliant, radiant. It's obvious. It's, it's more money. It's more X, Y, Z. Okay? Sometimes your world has to crash down for you to realize something. Sometimes you really have to buckle down with a budget or something. It's like teaching you the hard way, too, because that's a thing, too. And then next thing you know, within a couple months, you just created this brand new department that is extremely useful. Okay, Because when it's said and done, this is who you are. Dreams are coming true. I really do think it involves travel for some of you. You are alpha. I will tell you, it honestly looks like your boss is feminine. That is not a bad thing. Okay, you just got to know know your placement. I don't, I'm not really too worried about, I'm not really, I, I felt the need to say that, but I'm not, just don't step on toes. I don't really see it, but don't, don't step on toes. Okay. I love you guys. What a fantastic reading. I'll see you later, Gators. Bye.